वेलकम फ्रेंड्स आई एम गौरव देसले वी आर गोइंग टू परफॉर्म टुडे द ट्रांजेंस एनालिसिस ऑफ अ लिनियर सर्किट ऑब्जेक्टिव इज टू ऑब्जर्व द बिहेवियर ऑफ लिनियर सर्किट अंडर ट्रांजेंस कंडीशन सिम्युलेशन प्लेटफॉर्म आई हैव यूज इज अ मैट लैब टू थाउजेंड थर्टीन ए द बैकग्राउंड लिनियर सर्किट आई हैव एक्सप्लेन दिस लिनियर सर्किट इन द प्रीवियस वीडियो ऑफ अ स्टडी स्टेट एनालिसिस यू कैन रेफर दैट देन द ट्रांजेंस एनालिसिस Uh, is the analysis of the circuit during the time it changes from one steady state condition to another steady state condition uh, transient analysis will reveal the how the currents and voltage are changing during the transient period transient phenomena is an a periodic function of time and does not last longer the duration for which they last is very insignificant as compared with the operating time of the system uh, yet they are very important because depending upon the severity of this transient the systematic result into blackout of the blackout in a city shutdown of a plant fires in some building etc so we will see the circuit diagram for this next uh, transient analysis of linear circuit circuit diagram you have to just draw the diagram like this and uh, put the uh, parameters of voltage and current all the stuff like this uh, i will just put this pdf in the description so that you can refer so further the results and wave waveform which is uh, very important to get from this circuit diagram simulation using a continuous solver so start the simulation and observe line voltage and load current transient turning load switching and note that the simulation starts in steady state as shown here simulation starts in steady state normally uh, time of load switching i will show yes yes it is 0.04 uh, is the time of switching from one load to another and then uh just before the 0.12 second the load switches to another load so tra that transient stalker in a v line and for i load the current waveform is looks like this then further using the power guide to obtain steady state phasors set initial states so for initial states we have states all the initials to zero apply okay then uh, yes it will show like this at the initially it will show the transient because we have set all the initials to zero this is the way only way form then uh, discretizing your circuit and simulating at fixed step you can discretize your circuit uh, of a sample time 50 e Minus five, uh, solver type testing, and then you can see this uh, discretizing waveform. It is not side to side; it is discretized, discretized as shown here. Then further uh, using the phasor simulation method, uh, you can uh, when you double click on power guy, you can change the phasor frequency sixty hertz. Uh, simulation type to phasor then uh, you can further change the parameters or get the parameters like a magnitude magnitude angle real imaginary or complex uh, when i click on the magnitude i will just get the v line and i loads magnitude when i will click on the real or imaginary it will show that values or complex values or uh, magnitude angle values so in this practical we conclude that uh, we have studied the change in the voltage and current waveforms when transient occurs discretizing the circuit and uh, simulating in a fixed steps as requirement and how to get uh, different phasor simulation waveforms of your circuit this is my conclusion so thank you